Welcome everybody to another edition of the Carter Hour. Late night with Carter Hour, I guess. Um, I kind of wanted to uh, touch base with uh, a couple of my videos that I just had posted. Um, the first one was about, uh, or the recent one was about uh, 72 year old Dick Thompson uh, from Madison County, Indiana, or Alexandria, uh, Indiana. Uh, was getting evicted from his land, his family property. Now, I just wanted to offer uh, the viewers um, my position, you know, and I usually don't get uh, that upset in the video, and, you know, I hope it didn't scare you away. Um, but I was really upset about uh, that, and I had actually come across that, um, that uh, story today. Um, via a few other YouTube users. Um, uh, I uh, listen to Alex Jones quite a bit, and um, I actually came across that story um, regarding, uh, regarding, you know, uh, Alex and, uh, or regarding uh, Mr. Thompson from Alex Jones. Um, I got really upset. It's hard not to get upset when you have government beating up on an elderly gentleman like Mr. Thompson. Mr. Thompson has the right to live the way he wants to live. We all have the right to live the way we want to. Um, it's not the government's responsibility, nor is it... Um, I was wondering if that was focused. Um, nor is it the government's right to tell us anything. It's actually our right to tell the government what to do because we hire them and we fire them. Uh, the globalist elitists uh, are, are trying to run our lives. And I was very upset. And I, the thing is, ladies and gentlemen, and I wanted to kind of do a footnote to the couple of videos and have another... Um, I have another video... Uh, that I want to discuss here in a second, but um, that people are just so consumed with electronics and iPhones and um, Blackberries and computers and television. And this is what the global elitists want us to be consumed with because of the fact that it gives them more of an advantage keep you blinded with the football and the baseball and the basketball games um, I never watch sports I think it's a waste of time now I know a lot of you will disagree with me there but I mean that's my opinion and I'm not saying that you're bad that you that you're watching football games or anything but people are just so consumed by it they're so consumed with all the things that they're doing. They don't, I mean, you look at families nowadays and they, they hardly even talk to each other. They're either sending emails back and forth or texting or in voicemails. Things aren't like they used to be 20 years ago. And it's it's really hurting us. I mean, we're so consumed by all these kinds of electronic gadgets. Buying, we consume more shit from China every single day. Um, I'd like to share a story with you. Um, XM Radio is only available in Canada and uh, the U.S. And I, I have XM Radio. Um, and it's something that I don't find it's really worth paying for, but um, I have XM Radio. I'm a subscriber, and when you call, you get a foreign call center. They don't. And I ask them direct me to somebody in the United States or Canada because they don't understand what I'm telling them, and I'm not saying it's their fault. But we have we're paying U.S. companies money for their services to give other people overseas jobs when 
last time I checked, there's plenty of Americans that need jobs. And I guess, I guess what I'm trying to get to, ladies and gentlemen, um, is that, you know, everybody is just so consumed when people out there need help, they're, they're, they're in hurting situations, they're continuously getting beat up by legal teams or by uh, governments or by their work or just just anything because the, and, and you know what they do they give up because people just don't want to deal with it that we, we've gotten to a point in America where we'll see a bill there might be some odd charges on it but we'll pay it anyways because we, we just are too lazy to deal with it and I admit I've done it myself before too I, I, I just don't understand why people are so consumed by um, materialistic things. Oh, you don't have an iPhone? Oh, you suck. It's like, what the hell? You know? And the only reason that I have these computers here is because this is my job. And I, and I admit, I'm consumed into my computer too. Just like everybody else. It's an addiction. Maybe we should just all unplug. But then, you know, I see the internet and using the computer as a good tool, too, because we're able to listen to people that have an opinion that's different from mainstream. Um, like me, or like Alex Jones, or like Michael Savage. Um, I just, you know, it's hard to... It's like, say, unplug from all this stuff, get rid of the cell phone, get rid of the cable TV, get rid of, and, you know, I, I swear, if we all just got rid of the consumables, we'd make the globalist elite fall quite a bit. If we just got rid of it for a couple months, just all of us cut our services all off at once. And, you know, Mr. Thompson, you know, and if you happen to come across this video, sir, I am sorry that we have idiots out there that treat people like you, sir, with disrespect. Um, and I try not to make these videos long because I know a lot of people don't like to sit there and, you know, hear somebody babble on. Um, so I'm trying to get to, you know, my points uh, quite quickly. Um, another situation is uh, um, my video, uh, the Carter Hour, Goodbye David's Farm, which I told you was the, the afterthoughts was the last video, and it is the last video. Um, I did turn comments back on to the Goodbye David's Farm, um, but there was so much hate and so much spewage of garbage from these supporters that I had to turn off the comments for a while but they're back on um, but they're by approval only and the reasoning is is because people are getting attacked people that are just voicing their opinion are getting attacked by these supporters like they're, they're, they're Doberman pinchers so I'm not going to allow that on my channel. I'm not going to allow the profanity and the attacks and the misspellings, um, which I'm not making that a big point, but um, and the facts of you know these people that are just spewing hate. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna have that on my channel. If you want to make a comment, you want to make a point, get it across. But don't call somebody uh, X, Y, and Z. 
because that's ridiculous and that's childish and ignorant and you know that. Um, other than that I just kind of wanted to do an update I hope I didn't scare anybody away off my uh, video getting so upset um, on that last uh, video that we uh, we put up there on the Carter Hour um, I just I just hope that uh, <clears throat> nobody got freaked out because that wasn't my point my point was to show my anger in case uh, one of those Madison County idiots um, uh, city of Alexandria in Indiana got on there and uh, was watching it I wanted to show how much uh, you know how I was so upset and that uh, you know um, it's happening across the United States um, what's going on I mean it's happening to everybody um, we just have to stand up and fight for our rights and you know the more the merrier to stand up for our rights so anyways this is just a rant video um, and an update video so um, again this is another edition of the Carter Hour uh, via the weed cam uh, update uh, late night and I uh, hope everybody's doing well and uh, thanks for watching take care